Imagine asking one friend for advice versus asking a whole team of experts. That is the difference between single agents and multi-agent RAG. Let me show you the main differences between the two RAG architectures and when to use each. In a single agent RAG, one agent does it all. It takes your query, retrieves relevant info from the document, and generates an answer. Think of it like a solo chef making your meal in the kitchen. It is fast and efficient, but it's limited by just one perspective. And one more interesting point. In its simplest form, a single agent rag is a router. This means that if you have at least two data sources, the agent will make a decision on where to retrieve the additional context for your prompt. With the multi-agent RAG, multiple agents collaborate. One or two agents retrieve data from different data sources and another analyzes the data, whilst another agent crafts a response. So there's division of labor and a clear definition of rules for the different agents in the multi-agent RAG architecture. Like a whole kitchen staff working together in a more complex and way more more powerful way. Use single agent rag when you are working with limited data or compute and you want speed and low cost solution. It is great for straightforward tasks like QA over docs or basic chatbots. Use multi-agent RAG when the tasks are at hand, require reasoning, multi-step plans, and a high level of accuracy and auditability. This makes it great for product design, workflow automations, and advanced personal assistance. Now you know the difference. If you want to see more code examples or build an agentic RAG system with me, drop a comment in the comment section and let me know what you want me to build and I'll do it in the next video.